Hey everyone, this is Angela at Bake It With Love, and today we're making our cod and papillote. Uh, it's basically a cod filet with some vegetables, and then we wrap it in a parchment paper envelope. So we'll see here what we do to put it together and how we wrap it. So we've got our parchment paper. Turn it so that the curled sides are down and you're not fighting those edges trying to roll up on you. We cut up some leek, julienne style, and some carrots, julienne style as well. I lay them down in kind of a bed that's going to fit underneath my cod filet. I've got some thinly sliced fennel there, some thyme sprigs, and then also I'm going to add some more fennel fronds underneath where I'm going to place my cod filet. Okay, now that's all ready for my cod. There we are, a beautiful cod filet set on top, and I scoot it forward, forward towards you there. Um, then I'm going to use some olive oil and kind of drizzle it on and around. That is the only moisture you need because the juice from the vegetables and the fish is going to be plenty of moisture. There's some salt and pepper too. Uh, but you're also welcome to, when you've got the pouch almost sealed up, you can add some white wine if you want. And then we topped it with some thinly sliced lemons, as you see there. I've got another sheet of parchment paper about the same size as the one at the bottom. And I'm going to start with this corner and fold it in kind of a triangular shape back towards my cod filet. And then you can work clockwise or counterclockwise, but start folding it in kind of smaller triangles coming in closer to the cod filet, working in right around it as you go. And I haven't sped up this section at all so that you can see exactly what I'm doing. I'm trying to get in a little closer here too. Um, I'm showing all the way around the cod filet and the vegetables. And then <laughs> I normally use something to kind of press it down and hold it. And I just grab the closest thing that I had on hand, which was my olive oil bottle. So whatever works for you, um, your meat tenderizer, a little mallet, whatever you've got in the kitchen. But the olive oil was, is what was next to me today. So that's what I use. And as you see here, we're going all the way around the cod. And it's just going to be a nice little circular pouch. You can do with smaller sections of fish. These are smaller. Um, and then they fit on the plate a little bit better, but this was a very, very lovely filet, and I wanted to give it lots of room to really steam well in there. Also, this is a super healthy way to prepare your fish. It's healthy, it's easy, and it is crazy delicious. This cod turned out so perfectly, just like it always does, and you can use any type of fish in there. This is a beautiful way to, to cook your fish up. Yeah, as you can see, I've gone all the way around, and there we are. I'm tamping it down with my little bottle of olive oil, or not so little, heavy enough to, to be effective here. I've got my oven preheated to 350 degrees, and I'm going to throw this in there for about 12 minutes, and it's going to come out. And you don't really need to check it, because it's going to be really perfect. Um, this is a 6-ounce cod filet there. Um, anywhere between about six and eight, 12 minutes, uh, four might be done a little faster. But you see me pulling back, peeling back at the edges here. Be careful of the steam. You can also just slit the top and release the steam. But I was trying to show you the cod inside. And if you see the way that it's flaked away, we know it's totally done. And it flaked like that because it was kind of curled over the bed of vegetables but it's just right. It's not overdone. It's perfectly tender. It is so, so moist and just beautiful. I hope you enjoy the video. I hope you try this out and uh, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe so you don't miss anything else from us. Thanks for watching and see you again soon.